Good day to all. My name is Mark, and I'm here with our matchup against Besiktas. And we are playing at home, but before we get started with that, let's go to our regular schedule. After our match against Dortmund, we beat uh, Go Ahead Eagles 3-0. And let's look at the highlights. Definitely, um, I enjoyed the fairly high scoring as well as the clean sheet. Especially for my goalkeeper, Andre o Oana. He needs to be strengthening up his skills. And let's look at the highlights. Overall, you know, the match was decent. All right, corner. Eunice, Klassen. Yep, it was, uh, you know, just the usual. And then, all right. We have Dykes with the good cross. Cassieta smashes in the shot 1-0 Eunice Bowser recycling it around Cassietta shot got stopped and we are moving all right the opposition has the ball intercepted and Ajax is circulating it up Cassietta sends in a cross beautiful shot from Klassen and it's 2-0 Tite Sink Graven El Ghazi Sink Graven Floated up a ball, Eunice smashes in the goal. And we cleaned up there, Casieta with 8.9 average rating, one goal, one assist, solid match. And then after that, we played an away game against Rhoda. I'm pretty sure I'm pronouncing it wrong, but uh, that's my best guess. And Casieta with the hat trick, Klassen and Nemanja pitching in those goals. And overall, I started at a mix of players just to be, you know, fresh for Champions League. All right, we have a throw in. Klassen. Cassieta with the huge header jumping over two guys. Pretty crazy, eh? Cassieta. You know, shot stopped. Mistake. Klassen smashes home the second goal of the game. Nemanja puts in a penalty. 3-0. Zifuk with the throw in and Ajax is circulating the ball moving back and forth something that is definitely as I've said before happens a lot in this year's game and yeah, Klassen, Nemanja, Kluivert, El Ghazi and Casieta smashes in his goal I believe that was his third goal Zifuk, oh no this is his third goal Cla uh, Casieta smashes in the fifth goal of the game, and we defeated them 5-0. Also enjoyed the clean sheet, which is always good for my goalkeeper who needs to improve. And yeah, let's get back to our match against Besiktas. All right, we're back. Let's get to the real deal everyone's been waiting for. Besiktas versus Ajax. So in goal, we got Oana. Tite, Veltman, Reidewald, and Dykes make up the back four with Nemanja and Boazer. Make up the two center midfielders with Yunus, Shone, El Ghazi as uh, attacking midfield, supporting Dolberg, our main and lone striker. We have Boer, Viragiver, Sanchez, Iting, Sinkraven, Zayik, and Traore on the bench ready to contribute when necessary. Most likely, they will contribute a lot. But before we get started, okay, we got some tunnel interview. It's just being rested. Talika, yeah, it's going to be difficult nonetheless. Bozeman. Okay. I'm gonna have to say aggressive. I expect nothing but a win. Not very motivating, that's for sure. And just gonna have to do these ones individually. I say to the defenders, I have faith in you. They look happy, but happy really means nothing if they can't produce anything on the field. Skip the intro. Nemanja to El Ghazi with a horrific cross that just went straight to the goalkeeper. And we need to fight. Okay, it's going attack. Dykes with the cross. Shone with the absolutely horrible execution on trying to get a shot off. Nemanja. All right, Dolberg. Shone off the post. Awful finishing from him. Not that I expect him to finish in the first place because he's bloody awful at putting a goal away. Gonna have to say, concentrate, guys. Come on. It's not this not this difficult to score a goal, is it? 
Ajax is uh, you know pretty famed for their goal scoring prowess. But Dolberg smashes it in, top or bottom right hand corner for him. Disgraceful attacking from the beginning, but we managed to get Dolberg to put in an early goal, which should help us on our way. But you never know because people always do stupid things and screw things up. Dolberg, Shone, El Ghazi with the beautiful cross. Shone, who I said had horrible finishing, manages to put that one away. Surprise, surprise, I guess, eh? I mean, he is 30, so even if he does have horrific finishing, um, he should be able to clean up the match. And Eunice picks up a stub toe, typical garbage from this game with bullshit injuries. And um, yeah, I'll sub him off. It's no big deal. He'll probably be gone for a week or two, which is just great because he's like my best left winger. Uh, don't get complacent out there. People stressed. Bunch of bull. Typical. I can tell you that. Typical um, Typical football manager jokes, as I consider them to be. Yeah, let's pull off Eunice. Who are we going to put in? Zaik. Hmm. Treore. How do we put in... Put in Sink Raven. He can play there, right? Yeah, he can play there. He's better as a winger on support, I guess. Don't want to get ahead of myself. Is Sink Raven any good there? Oh, he's actually pretty good. His crossing is really good, actually. So, he'll probably do fine. Tell our guys to concentrate. Shone. El Ghazi. Wow. Top right corner from, uh, from an assist from Dolberg. That was so quick, I didn't even get to see a chance from that. Okay. Dolberg heads it down. El Ghazi smashes it with a beautiful volley. And we got a goal. All right. Bowser is doing a pretty good job. El Ghazi's done a fine job. We'll keep, we'll keep the lineup the way it is for now. But I will consider to move on eventually. Nope, don't concede. Okay. All right, now we'll put in Iting for Bowser. Maybe not. We'll put in Zayik for Nemanja. Give this guy some game time. He really complains a lot for not playing. Not that I blame him. It's hard to find a good fit for him because he plays more of an attacking midfield. But my attacking midfield's packed with players that want to play. And then we'll put in Iting. Hmm, yeah, we'll put in Iting. Give him some game time. Tell him pressure's off. He's quite a young player after all. And giving him experience is quite necessary in my opinion. We'll play more discipline, dribble less, shorter passing. And the game's over. Okay. We defeated Besiktas 3-0. That's very, very good. And we are moving up. And we did. We probably have secured it. We just got to win maybe one more match or two more matches, and we should have secured second place. Dortmund's four points behind us after being defeated by yeah Real Madrid three 0 All right. If you enjoyed the video, give video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the YouTube channel if you are new. With three links below: Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Check those out. You'll uh, get updates whenever I upload videos. Thanks for watching once again. This is Royal Town FC united to triumph.